Hillary, when asked the gutsiest thing you've done, you said is personally to take the decision to stay in your marriage. Right. Absolutely. You know, I mean, obviously, I've been gutsy or tried to be uh, in public and political ways. But personally, uh, which is how I took the, the question, uh, making that decision was really, really hard. And I'm the first one to say it turned out to be the right decision for me. That's not the right decision for my uh, many of my friends or other women whom I know of. Their decision to leave was a gutsy uh, decision. But I think that's the other part of this book, Emma. We want people to feel the agency, the power to make the best decisions for them. And, you know, we were laughing the other night with Mary Beard at this wonderful event she uh, interviewed us at. Diana Nyad, who swam from Cuba to Florida. Now, not many of us would try six times to swim amidst sharks and lethal jellyfish. You quite like swimming with sharks, though, don't you? Well, I, I spent a lot of time with sharks. <laughs> but the point was, it was the right decision for her. She would have felt her life had not been complete unless, having failed in her 20s, she tried again starting when she was 60. So the personal decisions that we make are often you know, either played out in public, in my case, or they're behind the scenes. But we all have to look for an integrated life. I mean, how do we live the gutsiest, best life that each of us can? And the answer is probably different for every unique individual. Chelsea, when mm. your mum spoke about that gutsy decision, uh, and it's a very personal reflection, how did that make you feel? Because, of course, you were much younger then. I was much younger. Um, you, It was a decision that we talked a lot about between the two of us. It was always, though, very clear to me, even though I was younger and even though I know she felt enormous responsibility to me and to our family, you know, Emma, I was always very clear that that was her decision. Um, and I was old enough uh, to take responsibility, I think, for myself and to just feel like you have to do what you kind of believe to be right and gutsy. And, you know, I am I am here, whatever whatever you decide.